Hey everyone, I just wanted to make a really quick video. I've had a couple ladies in the last few days ask me how um, I apply my pigments wet. And after talking to a few ladies, I have learned that they are just taking their brush and just putting it underwater really quick and then just dipping it in their pigment and applying it. So that's actually um, probably not gonna work near as well. So I wanted to show you two ways that you can do your pigments wet. So first off, what I do is I take a cup of water if I'm not using my rose water, which this is what you want to use. If you don't have the rose water, you just want to take a cup of tap water and let your brush sit there while you are applying your foundation. That way your brush is getting good and wet. When you're ready to apply your pigment, you're just going to take your brush out and you're going to blot it. I just do like this on a rag, okay? And you're going to tap a little bit of your pigment out into your lid like this and you are just going to make a paste with it. So my brush is really wet and I'm going to mix this up and I'll show you what I'm talking about when I say paste. Okay, can you see the consistency there is no longer a mineral powder really, it is now a paste. Hopefully you can see that okay. So that is how you want to apply that on your lid and it's going to go on really nice and smooth and the color is going to be really vibrant. Now your second option, like I mentioned a second ago, is your rose water and if you really want your, um, your pigments to be very vibrant and to last much longer, the rose water is the key. So what you want to do with your rose water is the same thing and you are simply going to We'll use some Regal here. We're gonna tap a little bit out into our lid. Get it out here. Okay, I have just a little bit. And then you're gonna do, and I do it on the other side. I don't spray it directly on the pigment because it's gonna make a mess. So I kind of spray back here in the corner. That was one full spray that came out. You can see there's now liquid in there. And let me get this heavenly off my brush. Now my brush would be dry, or it's fine if it's still damp. Either way is fine. And you're gonna do the same thing. You're just gonna mix that up in your lid, just like this, to get yourself a really good paste. If it's too wet, get you a little more pigment in there. If it's too dry, obviously spray a little bit more rose water in there. But that's gonna be the perfect consistency. If you apply your pigments on too wet, you're almost washing the color off as you're applying them and obviously if they're too dry your color is not going to pop near as much and it may get down on your cheeks so this also keeps them intact when you apply them to your lids so hopefully that helps explain a little bit better and um, thank you for watching y'all have a great day